Good morning, yogis. Welcome to this morning practice. My name is Camila, and I will be guiding your little 20 minute practice this morning. So something to awaken the body, awaken the energies in the body. And we'll start with a gentle yoga. So this uh, class is suitable for people who are just beginning with yoga or people who have their practice already, yet they want to um, just create some new movements in the body. So I just will give you a little moment to get ready, prepare your yoga mat if you didn't do so yet. You can pause the video and get a yoga mat. You can get a blanket as well because we will do a lunches, low lunches. So you can use the blanket as a support under your knee. So the knee is nice and comfy. Okay, very good. So let's get started. We'll start on our yoga mat. Sitting. And here you can use also the support of the block or a bolster if that feels comfortable. You can place it underneath your sit bones. Lovely. So you can sit in cross-legged position. If you have a problem with your hips and the knees do not want to open to the sides, you can support them having a pillow or some elevation underneath your thighs, the side of your thighs. Lovely. So we'll start with the little centering practice. So you can close your eyes and just connect with your breath. Breathing in and out through your nose. Really allowing the breath to travel spontaneously through your body. So natural breath. And just for a little moment, observe how are you feeling physically today? How are you feeling emotionally, energetically, and mentally? So just bringing your awareness to the present moment. And see your breath. And here you can set your intention for the practice. So whenever we set the intention, all the energies in the body and the universe are conspiring to help us. Just setting an intention and letting it go. Beautiful. And now you can gently open your eyes. You can gaze softly in front of you. And we'll start with little rotations of your neck. So little rotations from one side to the other, not the full circle, so half circles, half moons. So from one ear, from one shoulder to the other shoulder through the center of your body. So here we are opening the trapeze at the back, also opening the side muscles in your neck. And just awakening the body very, very gently. Nice and lengthen. And now inhale, leave the arms up, all the way up. And here you can just like move one side and the other. So opening here the side of your body from your hip. So as you would stretch after waking up. So just like opening rotations in your wrist in here. 
And bringing shoulders away from the ears. Nice. And now interlock your fingers, stretch to your arms all the way up, opening the palms of your hands towards the ceiling. Looking up, all the way up. Nice. Release your arms all through the center, all the way behind. And here, interlocking your fingers at the back and bringing your shoulder blades together and stretching down. So here the neck is completely free. You can move your neck freely. Breathing in and out through the nose. Lovely. And release. Shake your hands. Shake your fingers. Nice. Did I tell you that smile is compulsory during those yoga classes? <laughs> if I didn't, I'm saying that now. So smile is compulsory, especially when something is challenging and we want to do this. Oh, I don't want to do it anymore. Lovely. And now go on your, go on your knees for a moment in here and we'll go into all fours so hands are underneath your shoulders knees are underneath your hips and here we'll go into um, tucked toes so tuck your toes under nice breathing in and out through the nose and here we'll go into cat cows a couple of times so rolling your spine towards the ceiling chin towards the chest exhale and lengthening through your head arching your back tailbone looking up inhale roll your spine towards the ceiling breathing into the palms of your hands into your feet exhale Arch your back, open your head all the way up, awakening the tummy, moving the spine. So do it a couple of times in your own pace. Nice cat and cows in here, flexion and arching your back, your spine. So creating the space between the vertebrae. So the vertebrae are those lovely bones in your spine nice beautiful and now bring your body towards your heels in here nice so nearly you're sitting on your heels and this is a really nice stretch for your toes Beautiful. And here, press into your hands, press into your toes, lift into downward facing dog. So see what is happening here with your legs. And we're starting very, very gently. And move through your legs. So one leg at a time. So straightening the legs at the back. Yet it's okay to have your knees bent, especially if this is your first yoga practice today, this morning, or this evening, wherever you watch the video. Nice. So here, bend your knees and bring your torso a couple of times towards your thighs. Nice. Beautiful. And here, downward facing dog. So here, the heels are drawing down. The energy of the heels is drawing down towards the floor. So breathing in and out. Look between the palms of your hands. Nice. Bend your right knee and step your right leg all the way to the front. So here, bend your left knee place it on the floor and here the front leg you want to make sure that the ankle is aligned with the knee or else the knee is a little bit 
closer towards your body rather than over the ankle. The reason for it is just to protect the knee. <laughs> so here is the moment when the blanket will be very, very useful. So here first, what we're gonna do, we will go into a low lunge. So like you'll lengthen your torso, you can rest your forearm onto your right thigh. So opening here the glutes, working through the legs, it's really, really lovely. Okay, and now inhale, add your arms into it. Gaze between your arms, you can arch your back, opening your heart, opening your chest, breathing, allowing everything to move in the body. Beautiful. And now bring the palms together, bring them at your heart, turn your torso to the right side, bring your elbow behind your right knee and twist your spine to the right. We won't stay here for too long. So just a nice little twist. Your legs are still working, beautiful. Breathing in and out through the nose, nice, and coming back with your hand on the floor, opening your right arm all the way towards the ceiling, beautiful, bringing the right hand down onto the floor, and now here lifting the left knee off the floor, Nice, so keep it nice and lift it for the moment. Beautiful, and here go onto your heel. The front leg is going onto the heel, so we're stretching through the front leg. Really nice. Breathing in and out through the nose. Beautiful, now place the foot down, step to the front and now fall down into Uttanasana from your hips. So opening the back of the legs in here, you can still bend your knees and you can bend your knees generously. And breathing in and out through the nose, releasing completely your head, the back of your neck. Nice breaths into the whole body. Beautiful. And now inhale, roll up, roll through your spine, and rolling all the way up into the Dasana mountain pose. Standing nice and tall with the arms down your sides. Beautiful. Now inhale, lift your arms up all the way up towards the ceiling. Create a little arch in here in the back. Exhale, fold forward from your hips into Uttanasana, fall forward, fall. Nice. Breathing in and out through the nose. You can move your legs left to right, left to right. Beautiful, step the right leg back, wide, long, nice step back, bend your front knee, so the front knee is already bending naturally here, and bring your right knee all the way down onto the mat. Nice, and here we are working into the right quads, quads bending the right knee, so the knee is above the ankle, or closer to your body. And now here you can lift your torso. You can bring your forearm onto your thigh. So opening the hips, really good. And now lift your arms all the way up, all the way up, 
opening the arms, opening the chest, opening the heart, nice arch in the spine, breathing in and out through the nose. Bring the palms of your hands together, allow them to rest at your heart into the prayer position and now twist your body to the right. And here we're bringing the elbow behind your left knee and twisting from the waist. So that's a lot of movement for the spine, for the waist, for your body, nice twist. Just to awaken the digestive system, awaken our tummy, spine, breathing in and out through the nose. Nice, now bring the right hand onto the mat, lengthen through the left arm all the way up. Beautiful, place the left hand onto the, onto the mat and rise your right knee off the mat. You're moving a little bit forward and backwards, forward and backwards, forward and backwards. Beautiful. And now bring the left leg to join the right. Hip with distance apart. And here we're in a plank. Breathing in and out through the nose. Working through the whole body. Beautiful. Bring your knees down onto the mat and now we will lower the whole body down through the arms. So working with the core strength, lowering slowly and gently forehead on the floor first and then your torso, your hips follow. Bring the top part of your feet onto the mat and here Breathe in and press your feet into the floor, your pubic bone into the floor, bring your shoulders together, raise your torso up into cobra. So working here through your lower back, engaging your legs, breathing in and out through the nose, bringing your shoulders away from the ears. Nice. Exhale, forehead on the floor. Relax everything. Loosen, release your legs. Release the contraction in the, in the legs, in the buttocks. Nice, we'll do it two more times. So press the top part of your feet into the floor, your pubic bone. Bring your shoulders and elbows close to your body. Inhale, engage your buttocks and your legs. The muscles in your buttocks and your legs and lift your torso up into cobra. A little cobra in here. Breathing. Nice, and exhale, bring your forehead onto the floor, release your buttocks, release the muscles in your legs. Beautiful. One more time. Inhale. Engage your legs, your buttocks. Lift your kneecaps off the floor. Inhale and lift. Take a couple of nice breaths in here. Exhale and forehead on the floor. Beautiful. Nice. Release your hands down your sides. Bring your right ear to the floor. Breathe in and out through the nose. Beautiful. Bring your forehead onto the mat. And now bring the left 
left leg towards you. So grab your left leg with your left hand, uh, left ankle, and bring it towards your buttocks. Nice. And now bend your right knee and bring your right leg, right hip, uh, right <laughs> heel towards your buttocks. Pretty good. So we did open the quads today. So now we will bring both of your legs towards you and you will hold your feet from the inside um, of your body or actually outside of your sorry outside of your foot so you're holding both ankles in here close to your body so engaging the muscles in your back on the inhale we will lift the torso and your legs off the floor so inhale to lift and here you're thinking that your legs are nearly kicking the way up so engaging your legs engaging your shoulders and lifting your torso and your legs off the floor here exhale bring everything down beautiful release your legs down bring your hands down your side left ear on the floor beautiful so opening our back and now resting lovely and now bring your hands underneath your shoulders Elbows are close to the body. Inhale and push and go all the way up and back with the buttocks towards your heels into a child's pose. So nice resting pose. Nice resting pose to finish the practice for today. Just feeling the movement in your body, the fresh energies, fresh oxygen entering every cell in your body. Beautiful. So now make your way up onto your knees. So sit on your on your heels, bring the palms of your hands onto your thighs, lengthen your spine, close your eyes. Well done. You completed your physical asana for today so now gather all those benefits into your physical body allow it to support you for the rest of the day and connect to the feeling of gratitude Gratitude for your beautiful body to allow you to practice. Gratitude for giving yourself time to practice. Gratitude for this beautiful community so we, we can practice together. Bring the palms of your hands into your heart. Namaste.
to seal the practice. <laughs> Thank you so much, yogis. I hope you enjoyed your practice. You can share your comments and observations with me. I uh, will be very happy to read them. Thank you so much and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. <laughs>